Well, now that the beach season has begun, there are growing concerns about a certain chemical found in sunscreen. Dr. Peter Ostro has more in tonight's report for your health. These sunscreens are supposed to protect you against sunburn and against skin cancer. But what if they contained an ingredient that might cause skin cancer? Some reports warn that retinyl palmitate, an ingredient in some sunscreens, might do that. One study found that mice exposed to sun developed tumors sooner if they had retinyl palmitate rubbed on their skin. The FDA has been silent. Two further studies were done, and we just don't know the results of those, and the FDA is sitting on them, and they aren't giving us a good reason as to why they're sitting on them. Senator Schumer held a video press conference today to, as he says, turn the heat on the FDA. But to sit on these, this research uh, makes no sense, and if the FDA would give us a decent reason as to why they're sitting on it, maybe they think the studies are inconclusive, that's fine, and then they'd have to do more study. Of these seven sunscreen products, only two of them contain retinyl palmitate. These two. And it's easy to tell if a product has that in it because they're required to say so right on the label. The AMA has just recommended that everyone should use sunscreen for protection. I asked Senator Schumer whether he's appealing to physicians for help. Have you been in touch with the AMA or the American Cancer Society or maybe the American Academy of Dermatology to to get their input? No, we're, we're going to reach, we're going to extend our net further. Our first inquiry was with the FDA, and we want to see what they have to say. But so far, they've been quiet as a mouse. Because if you don't have anything to say, those studies may be inconclusive, or they may not warrant any warnings. But just the inquiry by Senator Schumer has probably convinced some people, <coughs> excuse me, to avoid retinal palmitate, and that's okay, but make sure you do use a sunscreen. All right, we'll look for it. Thanks so much, doctor.